this video, I'm gonna show you how to create and set up your farm from your dashboard. After logging into your account, click on the Farms menu on the left sidebar. Then click on the Add New Farm button. Select your controller type. In this case, we use Windows for the running controller. Enter the serial number that you have got during the installation of the controller and submit. If your controller is connected to the monitor server, you will see this page asking a name for your farm. Enter your desired name and click on the next button. In the next step, you will be asked for device password. If you have changed the default passwords, add them here so that the program can read the data of the devices. If you haven't changed the password, skip this step. Your farm is added successfully. You can see them on your dashboard. It will take a few minutes to scan your network and find the miners. In order to open each farm setting page, click on the farm setting button on the farm you want to access its setting. You can change the name of the farm from here. This is my Nitor controller serial number installed on the farm. Configure password of devices. My Nitor will use this user password to communicate with devices. If your device's IP is different from the IP range of the controller, you need to define each IP range. And also you can add new IP ranges. Note that the IP range is different from the device IP. So if you don't know your network IP range, ask it from your network admin or contact us with a ticket or live chat. If you have a miner with the IP address 192.168.1.50, you could write like this, for example, IP address 192.168.1.1. Subnet mask 255.255.255.0 You can add the IP range from the dashboard too. If you had any question or problem, feel free to create a ticket from your dashboard or talk to us using website live chat service.